How is it possible this 15 foot tall plant eater with the biggest claws in history, the Therizinosaurus, came from this, a carnivore? It's a story 160 million years in the making. A story about Therizinosaurus' evolution, which may be more bizarre than the animal itself. Our story starts 230 million years ago in the late Triassic with this carnivorous dinosaur, the Eodromius. It was only 15 pounds and was a bit taller than your average cat. This animal seems insignificant, but its discovery made headlines. Why? Well, because it's possibly one of the first ever theropods, a group that will eventually consist of animals like Allosaurus, Spinosaurus, T-Rex, Velociraptor, and even Therizinosaurus. The theropods split into several groups like Ceratosauria, Spinosauridae, and more. But let's focus on a specific branch it split into, Silurosauria, a group that would give rise to T-Rex and even modern birds. Many thought the first members in this group lived in the early Cretaceous, 140 million years ago. But this may be very wrong. This is thanks to Ashanosaurus. The Ashanosaurus lived in the early Jurassic period, 196 million years ago, and is known from very few remains. Data shows it wasn't just possibly the first known Silurosaur, but also maybe the first very primitive Therizinosaur. This confused scientists because the first Therizinosaurs are also thought to have emerged 140 million years ago. This makes the Ashanosaurus a possibly groundbreaking discovery. This animal is very controversial and a lot more study needs to be done, but if true, it would shake our understanding of Silurosauria and Therizinosaurs. The big definitive change for the Therizinosaurs though would come 139 million years ago in the early Cretaceous. This is Falcarius, a pretty small animal at 4 feet in height and 12 feet in length. This animal would change Therizinosaurs forever. It wasn't a primary carnivore like its ancestors, but rather an omnivore. This is a transitional form telling us the story of how Therizinosaurs first became plant eaters. It also gives hints at how the weird body plan of Therizinosaurs arose with its pretty long neck and relatively big claws, despite having a small carnivore type appearance and long tail. Other similar animals would arise some 10 million years later, such as Jiangchangosaurus and the small Bapialosaurus, which has direct evidence of feathers or proto feathers. From here, the Therizinosaurus began to grow and conquer. Sujosaurus, Nemongosaurus, Erlikosaurus, Nothernicus, Segnosaurus. Therizinosaurus, the biggest of the Therizinosaurus, a story 160 million years in the making.